Hi, my name is Connor Herlock. I was part of Marymount High School's 2017 graduating class. I'm currently stationed out in 29 Palms, California as a Lance Corporal of the United States Marine Corps. One positive aspect the Marine Corps has had in my life since joining is that it's taught me a lot about leadership and how to be somebody that your workers underneath of you can learn to depend on. Hi, my name is Chris Martin. I was a lieutenant in the United States Navy and I graduated from Marymount High School in the year 2000. When I was in high school and growing up, I loved being part of teams. I was uh, on the soccer team, I did plays, did musicals, did different clubs, uh, and I always enjoyed being part of something bigger than just myself. Uh, and in the Navy, I got to develop that and, and learn a lot about leadership and how being part of a team and being a leader uh, are one and the same. Uh, you never have one role in the military. You always have your, your primary role and then what we call collateral duties. Um, and that always gave me an opportunity to get to know um, other people outside of just my division. Um, you get to know everybody on the ship and knowing uh, how people tick and what makes people go and knowing that you can all pull together and that you can only succeed if everybody does their role uh, was something that I always valued and learned uh, in leadership that I've been able to carry on with me uh, outside and past the Navy. Um, I also um, have always been very proud of our, our country and uh, being in the Navy gave me the opportunity to help do my part, my small part, to help defend the ideal that our country stands for. Um, and even though sometimes it may be challenging to see the greatness in our country, if you just look around you, uh, you can see that ideal in action. And I'm very proud to have served in the military, and I'm very proud to be from Marymount High School. And I appreciate you guys taking time to acknowledge Veterans Day, and uh, go Warriors. Hi, I'm Justin Siegel. I graduated from Marymount in 2000 and joined the Marines the same year. After seven years, I attained the rank of Staff Sergeant, and I would say as a result of my service, the three biggest things that have translated to the civilian world are discipline, self-confidence, and the drive and will to win or be successful no matter what. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Alex Sutton. I graduated Marymount High School in 2011, and I'm currently a second lieutenant in the United States Marine Corps. Over the past two years, the Marine Corps has taught me how to be accountable. Being accountable means holding yourself responsible for your own actions. Being responsible for your own actions will ultimately help you be successful at everything you do. When you're accountable to yourself, you're also accountable to others. Your friends, your teammates, and those around you will be able to know that they can trust you and rely upon you. As each of you pursue your own careers, being accountable will help you succeed and to stand out from others. So be accountable to yourself and to others and you won't fail. With Veterans Day coming up, it's a great time to reflect and acknowledge those who have served. Our veterans were not only accountable to themselves, but to our country. They led us through many battles and made where we are today possible. So remember to be respectful and thankful for those who have served. Happy Veterans Day. Super Fidelis, always faithful, who rock. Hey Warriors, this is Drew Govey, class 2017 and current Army Cadet at the United States Military Academy at West Point. Some personality traits that have been strengthened as a result of my military service is I noticed I've become more positive. There's been countless situations where the conditions were just awful. We had to do some things that we'd rather not do. Being positive in that moment really boosts your motivation, and when it's over, you realize it wasn't so bad. Secondly, I've noticed I've become more resilient. i noticed that I want that extra challenge. I want that extra mile. I want whatever is going to make me better because I know it will prepare me for whatever is to come. Lastly, most important, I've noticed I've become more selfless, whether it's stopping whatever I'm doing to help someone out or striving to do things for the betterment of the group. Being selfless has shown me how putting the group before yourself really creates a successful organization. Thanks, guys. Go Army. Beat everyone. How are we doing, Warriors? My name is 2nd Lieutenant Danny Renner, United States Marine Corps. Yes, I do know that I share the same name as your principal, and yes, I do know who that is. So today my mission is to talk to you all about three traits that I've learned as part of my military service. The first trait I'd like to talk to you all about is leadership. Leadership in a nutshell is taking care of those under you and atten attending to their needs so that they can accomplish the mission. Leadership means putting them before you in every instance and in every situation. The second trait I'd like to talk to you all about is discipline. A lot of people like to talk 
as if motivation is what accomplished tasks. Motivation never accomplishes tasks because motivation runs out very quickly. Discipline is doing what needs to be done even when you don't want to do it. Practice discipline every day and that is the key to being successful. The third trait I'd like to talk to you all about is pride. Pride means believing in the mission, believing in the organization that you are a part of, and believing in those around you. I know that you all know about pride because I know that you all are proud to be warriors, just like I am. Warriors, I hope you have a great rest of the week, and hoorah!